When actor James McDaniel steps in a room, you notice he's tall, distinguished, and his vocal pipes carry weight. As 30-year veteran detective Jesse Longford, McDaniel is one of the main stars on Detroit 187, and he was banking from the start this show would be a hit. Think you got a hit on your hands? I, I don't care for, about protecting my heart right about now. Um, I know we got a hit on our hands. Now as the series winds to a close on television and the shooting is done for the season, we spoke to McDaniels by phone from his home in New York. Now what's your gut telling you now? after the wrap of the season, because a lot of people in Detroit are praying that Detroit 187 is going to stay here. What, what's your gut feeling? Will you be back next season? Um, I, I believe it. In my mind, we are a hit because, um, you know, people say the show got better and better. McDaniel, who grew up in Harlem, loves the gritty streets of Detroit, and he's hoping this series he's grown to love will be back. So you just finished wrapping Detroit 187. So how was the final day on the shoot? It was a wonderful day. I called everybody together, and I gave them a little talk. I started with the fact that, you know, I've been in this business for 32 years, and this is the finest crew that I've ever worked with. One of the reasons Detroit 187 was shot in the city was the Michigan movie tax incentive. Since it was launched in April of 2008, it's generated $650 million in this economy and created 6,700 production jobs. That's now in jeopardy with the governor's budget cuts. The talk of violence in Detroit never fazed McDaniel, and he believes Detroit 187 not only put the Motor City in the Hollywood limelight, it should put Detroit in the history books as well. One is the first national network TV show ever shot in Detroit. I believe that we've employed more people of color on this show than any show in the history of national network television as well. This series pumped $25 million into our local economy and provided steady work for many local companies. McDaniels and the entire cast of Detroit 187 made quite an impression on the city, and they've all grown fond of us as well. I want you to let them know that we have loved our experience working there in Detroit. You know, I miss it already. I think everybody else misses it already. Um, we formed a new family. We made new friends, and we really, really look forward to coming back. And don't be surprised when we do. See, he's predicting they will be back. Well, and I hope they are, because he's exactly right. The show has gotten better and better, and those viewers and those on the back channel, Twitter, I mean, they're all talking about how much better the show has gotten over the course of the year. It's, yes. it's, been, it's been great. Well, we'll know for sure in May. Now, there are two more episodes of Detroit 187 left this season. The final episode will air Sunday, March 20th at 10 p.m., only here on 7. We all got our fingers crossed.